Okay. Hey, it is Dr. Snobby back at y'all again. So this is what we're gonna do tonight. What we're gonna do is we're gonna make some holiday spaghetti. But before I cook it, I just wanted to introduce these certain ingredients that we're going to use tonight. First of all, we're going to need the pasta. The pasta is very important in making spaghetti. Y'all know that. But anyway, then you're going to need some of this ground beef. We're going to cook all this meat. We're going to be using this meat in this here wonderful, wonderful meal. But then what's important is the spices. The spices are, is what accents the meal itself. Now what we're going to be using is some pesto, okay? Now, you can make your own pesto, but if you don't know how, just buy it in already prepared in the glass jar. We're going to be using some different kinds of pesto and stuff. And here we're going to use some olive paste. Absolutely. And this here is some black olive paste, alright? We're going to be using some of this here basil. We're going to use it for the meat. I'm going to use some onions. These are organic onions, by the way. Just like this is organic basil. Good, good stuff here. Then we're going to be using two different kinds of oil. Okay? What we're going to use with this oil, we're going to um, put it on the pasta. Right after the pasta get done boiling, we're going to saturate this pasta with garlic oil. Then for the second one, we're going to use oil that has extracts of chive in it. So, while we're doing that, I just want to introduce y'all to some of these stuffed olives I got from Gallucci. That's right, I'm giving These are olives that are stuffed with, well, sun-dried tomatoes. Very nice, very healthy. Then, you have these olives here that are stuffed with garlic. Very tasty. Choose some gum afterwards. But we will be back with y'all. Alright, y'all, we're back. So what we're gonna do right now, okay? What we did, come on a little closer. What we did, ladies and gentlemen, we browned the ground beef, okay? We poured the water off of it. And now what we're gonna do, we're gonna add the pesto. Okay, what this pesto does, this is this adds flavor. You could just eat this stuff just the way it is. Okay? So what we're gonna do, we're gonna add a little bit of this. Just like that. Come on, look close. Just like this. Just eat right in that egg. Yeah, this is called pesto. This accents the meat. Okay. Get my trusty spoon. What we're going to do, we're going to stir this pesto up in there with the ground beef. Okay? Like I said, this stuff accents it. It gets give flavor. I mean, because with all this stuff we have in it, there's no need to add any salt or pepper. You know? And see, even the, I wish y'all could smell this. You can tell that this stuff is very, very robust. Just, just accents. Like I said, I can, I can never stress the word accent. It accents the meat. So that's phase two. And I'll get with you. All right, now we're back. And you're about to see the end result of this meal. Now check this out, girl. Yeah. Okay, let me go in this oven now. And do this hot shit. Now take a look at that. Take a look at that. That is what you call perfection. And this is what you call Dr. Snyder's man. So, y'all have a safe holiday. Fuck Christmas, but eat anyway. <laughs>